Hello, YouTube. I am a very oh, old... Oh, Oh, shit. Yes, we are. I'm a very old person from England. Um, I'm Henry the Ape, and I'm fat as fuck. With me in a Google Live is live from the IRA base in Ireland. Um, we have Father Ted. Ah, oh, Jesus, a bit controversial there. Yeah, so um, Father Ted's going to be with me, and we have come straight to this time to talk about the stupid shit that our actions have led to. He raped children, and I hung women. Yeah. You didn't really hang them, though. You more, like... I ordered the execution of them. Yeah, but they weren't really hanged. They were more had their heads chopped off. I ordered their execution, it's fine. Yeah. I'm still responsible for them. Which makes me evil. Evil. Jesus Christ. Anyway, despite, so... Despite that, I can tell you all, you probably fed up with me. Yes. How, <laughs> however did you guess? Um... A few things gave me gave you away. Those being? No, no, no. I don't. I don't need this right now. Let me show you. Let me. Let me get one more. One. Let me. Let me get. I. One I. I, more. I don't need this right now. Let me give you one. Yeah. Why are you me? I. I don't need this right now. <laughs> Henry, what? What's going on? What? I'm being raided. That's what's going on. <laughs> and you will address me as king. King. Yeah, because I am the king. You sit off. Oh. Yeah, but I am, I am, yeah, I'm being raided by the French. You realise I can only see your hair. There we go. Okay. Not that I'd want to see it, but I think the right. Go to your father, go on. You too. I'm a very naughty boy, yes. Now off to your father, go on. Eh. Stop that! You too! Get out! Can we get on? Okay, yeah, go on. What's, what's your... Second? Okay, so... Stop! Well... Yeah, go on. Last time we were doing this, someone asked us if we could talk about donkey punching. Oh yeah, donkey punching, go on. So, this is the Urban Dictionary definition. The donkey punch is when you are engaged in anal sex, and when you're about to ejaculate, you punch the poor little lady in the back of the head. So her anal cavity tightens, making the orgasm all the more better. For you, of course. So... I just imagine that one guy that does it with, like, a hammer. Thor. <laughs> and just completely knocks her out. <laughs> what? Like Thor? Yeah, basically. Just Thor goes... Argh! I think her head would explode, but still. <laughs> Uh, or a brute with a Just, gravity hammer. Yeah. Oh, um, by the way, hello the one viewer that's watching. Oh, we've got one viewer. Hi. One live viewer. Okay. Um, oh, yeah, by Please. the way, last time five people watched live. So, yeah. Okay, we still need... um. Come on, someone comment. Yeah, on someone, comment. Com someone comment shit. Um... Yeah, I mean, most of the viewers we get is actually going to be, like, once we're finished, and yeah. I'm just, like, um, I, I just, like, tell everyone, hey, guess what, what the fucking, um, you know. Okay, so, do you um, want to talk about news until someone actually gets back to me? Okay, that's, that's... Good. Okay, now, um, 
Oh. Okay, so here's something from the NYPD, so you know it's American. Oh, uh, here we go. <laughs> Straight to the good ship. A female student who was aged 17 brutally beat her classmate, okay, a male classmate, who farted in her direction. How can someone justify that? Maybe, I don't know, maybe it was uh, a really, really bad fart. Wait, wait, this happens in America, right? Yep. New York. Sarah wasn't around, was she? No, she wasn't involved, I don't, I don't think. Uh, well, New NY stands for New York. N no shit. So, and she doesn't live there. Uh, okay. Oh, this is bullshit. Facebook is starting to restrict violent video clips and photos. Oh, yes, because I've always liked watching people getting murdered on Facebook. Yeah, I mean, there are these stupid videos that what, you see someone get cut in half with a buzzsaw and things, but, like, you should have the freedom. Yes, but I'm, I'm going to use a really stupid argument. Think of the children. If the children want to go on it, then it's their own fault. Jesus Christ. Just, no. We should have the freedom. It's, it's not a question of whether we want to look at it or not. It's the question of whether we have the freedom to look at it. And if we have the freedom to look at it, then, yeah. That uh, speech just died at sun death. That has to be the most libertarian thing I must have heard anyone say. We must let people look at what they look at, but if they don't want to let it look at it, they have to look at it because it's their stupid. No, 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 no. That's basically That's, what um, I heard from No, you. they don't have to look at it. It's the thing that they have the choice. Because what happens if you just stumble upon it, though? Then it's your own damn fault. <laughs> <laughs> and come on, everyone knows that. Mm. Okay. Yeah, so. well, okay what's next? Let me, let me try and look. Okay, so stupid teenage girls offer themselves as wives for ISIS fighters. Not people who fight ISIS, people who are fighting on the side of ISIS. Wait, sorry, what? Repeat that. Wives, teenage girls, are offering themselves to sleep and marry men from ISIS. For fuck's sake. Yeah. Um, I mean, just so this doesn't turn into like a terrorist debate, the free viewers who are watching, go on to Theo's fucking um, Facebook, please. Facebook yes, please. And, and add something interesting, please. Yeah, anyway, because yes. until then it's going to be about terrorism now. Yeah. I mean, what the hell? Those women are basically encouraging the terrorism. Exactly. I'm going to go fight for ISIS now because I want teenage pussy. <laughs> you fucking read <reach> them. <laughs> <laughs> Henry, you just need to go to a nightclub at, <laughs> at 12 o'clock at the at night. And Say hello to a girl and they'll sleep you, you. And then you can pick up any amount of teenage pussy for about two pounds. <laughs> I think two of those teenage, um, the teenage pussy is, was watching because we just lo lost two thirds of our oh. <laughs> <laughs> what are you drinking? I want some. Um, I'm I'm drinking you and. Ah, oh, I want some. You want some? Oh, okay. Yeah. You know, Ailstorm made a song about drinking piss. Okay, please don't sing it because we might get into copyright issues. I'm not going to. I don't even know how it goes. Okay. 
I, I like drinking piss. It gives me wood. Sorry. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> you are crazy. <laughs> Is this new? Is this a new revelation for you? No, I just decided to state it. Okay. Uh, I'm back. Anyway, um... Oh. Uh, so... <laughs> um, okay, okay, what? okay, okay, get this, okay? There's a 22-year-old man... And... He has been arrested... <laughs> <laughs> can you hear that? Yes, I can. I <laughs> Okay. Wait, which brother is that? Is that It's it's Yusuf. Yeah. Yusuf. Yeah, anyway, so he's been arrested because he called um the, the emergency hotline thirty times a day while masturbating when male officers answered. <laughs> Well, I guess that he just wanted some help. <laughs> Hello? Henry? Where have you gone? Bastard. I don't know if you can hear me or not, so I'm just going to swear at you. Where the fuck are you, you cunt? Oi. Henry. Oh, for fuck's sake. Henry. Oi! Oh Christ. Technical difficulties. Hello? Oi, where were you? I lost connection for a bit. Oh. How long was I off? Uh, for about two minutes. Okay, I'd like to apologize to people in the audience. Good. Um, yeah, they, they didn't know where I was. Anyway, yeah, so did you get... How much of that joke did you get? Uh, I didn't get any of it. The phone call joke. Oh, damn. Okay, so there was this guy, he called... Um, the police and he was jerking off. Well, uh, I think. Anyway, this is this is how I imagine joke the uh, call went. Hello, hello, sir. This is the police. Yeah, I need help. Why is that, sir? I've been jerking off for like three days straight now. I've been, uh, I've lost my job and everything. I need to I need to come real quick. He's like, how is this an emergency? I need to come. I need to come. Yeah, that's how you I know what this is it. reminding me of? Go on. The bloke that forced off 15 officers whilst masturbating. <laughs> yeah, I, I, you showed me that video once, didn't you? Yeah. This is no, it wasn't stories. a video. Was it? Oh, I remember no, seeing a video just, of it. It was just his mugshot. But imagine, okay. that's pretty good. That's pretty good going. I remember I remember seeing a video where someone like fought off police with no, with like no trousers or something like that. Oh and um man police leads man on a brief chase. <laughs> <laughs> I've seen that. Okay. I that uh I have just you know got a comment. Go what on. is better? Lottie says what is better? Apple or Windows? I haven't. That is a difficult much. one. Ah. 
This is this is uh, like she just said. Just be careful because some people may get offended or get rude. You know. Damn straight. Damn straight. Yeah. People this should get offended probably. at this. This is the most offensive uh, podcast ever, probably. So yeah. Okay, um, I'm gonna go for Windows, and I'm gonna apologize for those who get offended. Um, here's my right. apology. Fuck you, that you're a little pussy. There you go. Oh, good. Yeah. I. To be honest, I agree with you. I think because Windows is much cheaper, and also I don't really see much um, difference in like processing power and so on. I only see one good, be better thing with Apple. That's the thing. That this is it. Okay, they don't have pop-ups. Once with Windows, I lost a very important po file to a pop-up that advertised the stopping of pop-ups. <laughs> that's, that's like I should I should go to the company. Who <laughs> that's the <laughs> ultimate troll. That I is the ultimate troll. I should go to the company that made it with a shotgun and <laughs> sell first aid kits as well. Just like, hey sir, do you want to uh, buy a first aid kit? No. Bang. How about now? The price just went up to thirty dollars, motherfucker. Yeah. Anyway, so I must say I prefer Windows because it is cheaper. There's not really much difference except personally I find Windows easier to use. So I just think it's better really. Because he bought an Apple and couldn't afford a doctor. Sorry, what? Steve Jobs died because he bought an Apple and he couldn't afford a doctor after that. I'm joking. It's, it's a very bad joke. It's still, is it still too yeah. early to make Steve Jobs death jokes? Well, I don't think so. Okay. But, yeah, that's still a bad joke. <laughs> yeah. Okay, here's, here's news that obviously came from America. Okay? Here from we the, go. From the okay. state of Texas... Someone compares Obama to Hitler. <laughs> well, it's like um, the Oxcast always say, literally worse than Hitler. <laughs> so what like, do you think about so, Obama and Hitler? How do you think they were the same? How were they... Um, yeah, how were they doing it? I don't how know. Some some guy just some Texan guy just said, oh, he's oh Hitler. of course he's of course he's Texan. This is the same guy. These are the same people that said when um that said when Barack Obama won the election, they said that Satan is now in control of America. <laughs> he spelled Adolf wrong as well. What did he spell it? A D O L P H. <laughs> For fuck's sake. <laughs> okay, so with the corrections, he I'm this is what he tweeted. Even Adolf Hitler thought it was it's more important than Obama to get to Paris for all the wrong reasons. Obama couldn't do it for all, okay for all the right reasons. This is um, the terrorist that killed a bunch of Jews in a um, in a store. Okay. Yeah, and he's saying, "Oh, Obama can't help French people, you know, like because he's evil, because he's worse than Hitler." Sorry, so Obama, one of the. Possibly one of the most peaceful presidents that uh, the United States has had is worse than a guy who slaughtered millions and millions of Jews and disabled people. Yep, that, that's how it goes. That's how the world works these days. Kill lots of um, disabled people and people that aren't your religion and um, people who love you For and hate you. You know, I think if Korea really did have nuclear weapons, they should direct them at the southern states. I mean, come <laughs> on. After hearing that, 
Uh, hey, my ex-girlfriend is there. And she can, you can warn her, get a plane out of her before they strike. Surely. Hmm? Surely, somehow. Thing is, she probably will. <laughs> perhaps perhaps when they pull out of the rubble, she'll have like 10 vaginas. You'd like that. I would, yeah. How would you even make use of that? Um, when one gets sore. <laughs> oh, God. You've got nine others. <laughs> <laughs> and, like, they probably would have formed at different times, so they'd have periods at different times as well, so you can, like, drink blood at all times of the year. For corn cares not from where the blood flows. And for those of you who do not get that, fuck you, because you're not nerds. Yeah, we are, we are the Hardcore. true nerds. Hardcore nerdcore! I really wish I had some, some Warhammer models. I have some Warhammer models, actually. I know. They're not finished yet. How? When, when did I tell you I got them? That must have been sometime last year. Yeah. Yeah, the problem is they're so fucking expensive. It's like... Yeah. That's why I only go for the books. You know, I've managed to buy most of the books for two pence. On Amazon, you can buy second-hand books for two pence, and it only costs two quid for shipping. I would never buy a Warhammer book for two pence. Why? It's, it's the best deal I've ever had. Because um, Warhammer books are like the Bible. I would pay a gold brick for a Warhammer book if I owned one. A gold brick, that is. The, 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 the Warhammer is the best. Blood for the blood god. Skulls <laughs> for the skull phone. What would you prefer? Um... Out of the two... Wait, how many series are there in Warhammer? I mean, main main series. What do you mean, main series? Like, the Horus Herod... You have the mini-series, like the Space Wolves series, the Blood Angels, so on. You know, sort okay. of individual chapters. And then you have the main ones, like um, the Great Crusade, the Horus Heresy, you know. I think, I think the Great Crusade would be the only main, main one. But before then, they had something called the Space Marines Battles novel, novels. Um, okay. And this was before they had enough books to put them into omnibuses. Alright. So that was basically it. And basically, there's one of every chapter now. Not like omnibus of every chapter. Even, even like really obscure chapters that no one's heard about. Half the book is explaining where the fuck they came from, seriously. But that's enough about book. Let's get back to um Yeah, we haven't stupid news. Unfortunately we haven't had any more things. Another person was raped in India. Of course. That's not actually surprising to be honest. I mean New Year just it's so lawless. Apparently, like, I, I don't know how true this is, but apparently, like, every six seconds, someone is raped in India. That's the thing, because it's so difficult to, um... What's it? Keep the law at New Year? Because everyone's just all over the place. Mm -hmm. Let's fuck some bitches. Hey, look, she's still walking. Let's go at her. You you make it sound like they live like just everyone turns into rapists at New Year's. No, it's just New Year's. It's an opportunity for them because it's like the police are stretched thin as it is with all those drunks and so on. Here's something. Um, do you think there's more rapes at the equator or the north or south and south poles? Wait, do I think there's more rapes at the equator or north and south poles? Yeah, countries along the equator. 
I'd say along the equator, because at North and South Poles, it's just too cold to get it out. <laughs> okay, no, I, f I disagree with you. Why? Okay, here's why I disagree with you, okay? At the equator, it's really hot. Okay? So people yeah. take their clothes off, and there's a lot of fucking going on. That's why I don't think there's a lot of rapes there, because people are fucking, not raping. However, with the North and South Poles, they're like, oh god, not today, love, not today, love, Do tomorrow night. So he goes out and, and decides to rape someone. <laughs> oh god, I... <laughs> See, I think it's that. I think it's that reason. But at the equator, instead of uh, what you were talking about. But, but at the, it's it's warm during the equator, though. Is he saying that people are too hot to fuck? Wait, I think I have another. Do I have another one? <laughs> Oh, no. Ah, oh, that's a shame. Okay. Okay, yeah. I just got a Skype message from a really random person saying, I think it's exciting chatting with horny people. Would you like to chat now? Where are yes. we located? <laughs> yes. Let's, let's chat with horny people. <laughs> <laughs> no. I guess guess what this random person's name is? Go on. Amanda. Oh fuck you up, I know her. So, fuck you. <laughs> what, is it really? Yeah. Is it really I, Amanda? I don't I doubt it's the Amanda that you know. Uh, how oh, do I turn on the screen like... sharing? Screen share. It should be on the side. <laughs> there you go. Do you see that? I see snowflakes. No, down here at the around ah, the boss. Ah, right. Yeah, fuck you. Ask him for a second there. Okay. This is fun. <laughs> <laughs> Amanda, if you are that one person viewing, stop talking to him. He's a pedophile. I'm a... What, what are you talking about? You're a pedophile. I saw you fucking that kid. What? Interview, interfering <laughs> with yourself in confession. You know what you're doing is a mortal sin. She just said, let me ask you, A. Eh? What? She's asking for your, your... She wants you to give your second name first. <laughs> no, it's probably a program. Just ignore yeah. it. Yeah. Though I always enjoy just chatting bullshit with them. <laughs> it's just funny. I, I, like... The first day I got my new Skype account... If you don't know, this is my second. The first day I got my new Skype account... Um, I was contacted by someone called Peachy Myrtle. I think I got yeah, a, like, I think I got a random one like that. <laughs> and they're like, "I'm so horny. Are you horny? Come, come and give your credit card here and enjoy my private show." She says, "Do you like big booty girls with big boobs? Laugh my ass off, but for real, because that's what I am slash have." Is that too much for you to handle? Should I just rename this podcast Porn Lamps? <laughs> I just said, the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> just act like I'm completely son. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, so, guys, we have nothing to talk about at the moment. Okay, here's something. 
A man okay. steals 411 bucks worth of razors. Wow. Either he's yeah. planning to sell them on, or he has a really hairy girlfriend. <laughs> yeah. His girlfriend's Chewbacca. <laughs> 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 Have you ever wondered what, what like sex Chewbacca was? Like people assume it's male, but it might not be. But Chewie is always called a he. And the thing is that Chewie is called he by Han Solo, who probably knows more about Chewie than anyone else. Hint hint. <laughs> so was head high. Yeah. Oh, fuck me. That's disgusting. <laughs> no, it, it could be good. Okay, get this, okay? Han Solo. Han Solo. Chewbacca. Princess Leia. Boom! <laughs> you know, you know about Rule Thirty Four, do you? Uh, it's the, is it the one that if it if you can think of it, porn exists or something like that? Yeah. So I'm pretty sure um, porn exists of that. Okay, I'm not gonna check. Um, you can <laughs> check it if you want. <laughs> but yeah, Rule Thirty Four. Oh god. No. This woman is now saying, do you not know what a wooty is? Would you like to see me? I'll show you my wooty. Yeah, please tell me what a wooty is. I was going to show you what her wooty. <laughs> so go send me pictures of wooty. You've muted your mic. Hmm? You had muted your mic for a second. Oh. No. I just said, I know what a booty is, if that's what you mean. What the fuck? Someone tell me what the fuck a mooty is. A wooty. Yeah. A wooty. Why is it like a Chinese pussy or something? Asian it says, pussy. It says this hangout is only open to people aged 18 and older. I don't know. We've got two people watching. We were oh. ju you, like, for a short while we had zero, and now it's just gone up to two. We were just talking about porn. Okay, this this woman is now saying, Haha, Wooty is a white girl booty. I want to show you white my... White girl booty. A Wooty is a white person's ass. It's a white girl's ass. Basically. The fu who the fuck thought of this? <laughs> Do you know what? A, a booty should only be reserved for black people. Let's make one for white. Huh. <laughs> I do it's not like understand. That's, it's like just people that say, I'm not racist, but. Yeah. No. The best screenshot capture ever. It's of Nigel Farage um, with the subtitles saying, I'm not racist, but. Oh, God. You know Nigel Farage is... Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can't plead. Okay, for anyone watching that's not in England or the European Union, Nigel Farage is a man who is a closet racist and he wants um, all the immigrants out. Basically, Basically so he's, someone, he's an ass. Yeah, this is the thing. Someone called him a homophobe and a racist and he said, I'm not sure about the homophobe. <laughs> Really? Yeah. It's like saying that so two open... guys bumming. <laughs> it's like saying that two guys bumming each other is the only type of brown town he likes. Brown town. She just Why said, not? "Look, I am going to fix up my cam for you, sweetheart." Um, if if she does this all over Skype, screen share. 
and I'm going to record it, okay? If you want me to. Okay. Uh, full screen, screen share. <laughs> this is really <laughs> weird. <laughs> I don't think she's going to do it right now. <laughs> this is so strange. <laughs> okay, Snowflakes Joe is typing. I should have just said no from the start. <laughs> For any viewers watching, we're going to see Booty. Or, or was it Wooty? We're going go, to see Booty. Go to HTTP... No. Yeah, I, that's, yeah. That's fake. Yeah. I don't follow links on Skype. And that's a very important I, file. I'm not an... Idiot. I am. Um, I'm an idiot. I know, Henry. So, I know you follow links on Skype and everything. I follow links as long as they actually give me booty. Or wooty. That's my new favorite word now, wooty. Cause wooty. <laughs> yeah, wooty. Henry, I don't think anyone wants to see your wooty. <laughs> Are you sure I can twerk? Uh, I, I'd say keep that information to yourself. Well, I can twerk. I'll twerk on screen. No. I'll twerk. I'll fucking twerk on screen. Start I'd twerking. I love. I love how I said. I'm disconnecting. I'm disconnecting. <laughs> when I said, when I, no, when I said I'll twerk, we instantly got another view. <laughs> <laughs> no, seriously, if you start twerking, I will disconnect this. Well, you didn't you did have any objection to this when I was dressed as a woman. I've never been offered to be twerked on by anyone, so <laughs> I think I think you may have got the wrong person. Okay, maybe it was just someone who got. How, why that? Why is it every time we stop talk, we stop, we say the word twerk, someone joins the thing. When we stop talking about twerking, that guy leaves. Twerk, 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 twerk. twerk. Yeah, that guy. That guy just wants to hear the word twerk. <laughs> he just needs it's to like, say twerk all over. It's like that that song "Booty" by Iggy Azalea. Have you seen that? Have you heard it? Seen what, sorry? The song by Iggy Azalea called Booty. No. Uh, it goes something like this. She got a big booty, 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 booty. Oh, I'm rubbing yeah. my ass from another girl. But, um, I yeah. have heard that. Okay, okay, this woman, after I said I'm not an idiot, this woman just said, you do not have to worry, sweetheart. It's free to join, and the site, all you, all you have to do is register. Yeah, I think I know. I think I know this website very well. Of what? course you do. You, I bet you followed through with that site to count this yeah. time. I have, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm a premium member. I paid fifty pounds for premium. I'm, Wait. I'm watching, I'm watching someone's private show right now. <laughs> I don't know how much it is for premium. Yeah, I'm watching like five girls' private shows. Although Street for some reason, I'm not. I'm not. <laughs> okay. Let's see what she has to say. Fill out your credit card information for age verification only. Your CC will not be charged. Okay, do I'm it. ready I, for you I was, now. I was robbed of um, five thousand pounds. I'm surprised you even have five thousand pounds. I don't have one. I don't have five thousand pounds anymore. It was robbed. I'm surprised you ever had it. I'm surprised you ever had ten pounds. Um, yeah. I I did some bad things to get that money. I fucked dogs for some shit. 
You weren't sitting in Soho. Yeah. Just so, just so you ever know, people, I'm I'm a trap in Soho. I ask for people's money, they give me it, and we once we go to a private spot, they find out I have a sausage. You've muted your mic. No, I didn't. You did. It said your face, and then the the, the little thing that says you're muted. Like hmm? you muted your mic. My face is blah, 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 blah. You looked like a guppy fish. <laughs> Once I was told that I look, um, I I look like a pug. No, pugs are too handsome. I don't know. What do you look like? Okay, I, uh, any viewers, comment comment underneath the video. What does Henry look like? What animal? I've I've just got on Facebook and I saw your thing and I saw Lottie Mans Smith. She looks like the overly attached girlfriend. Everyone says that. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone. Says that. No, no. You know the um bits where she's got her eyes wide open like that, and she's yeah. all smiling. Yeah. Yeah. When Lossie does that, she looks so much like overly attached girlfriend. It's ridiculous. <laughs> yeah, Lottie, I think you need to like change your face or something. That's Buy a bit rude. At Come the on. store. That's a bit rude. What, you can't change your face? At a store? No. I can change my face at the store. Go on then, prove it. Okay. Okay, here's the mask. It's imaginary, okay? I'm going to make myself look like Daniel Craig now, imaginarily. In my mind, I look like Daniel Craig now. But in real life, you just still look like a retard. <laughs> you can talk. You look like a retarded sheep. <laughs> Who said that? What, retarded sheep? Yeah. I did. <laughs> Wait, you said I look like a retarded sheep. Yeah, you look like a retarded sheep. <laughs> Piss off. <laughs> you were laughing just a second ago, mister. I know. Because it's funny. That you should be saying that I look like a retarded sheep when even a pug is too handsome for you. <laughs> yeah. A man at Long Beach gets jailed for two years for killing cats. For killing cats? I mean, yeah. come on, killing cats is a terrible thing to do. But Actually, no, here's something I want to show you. Yeah, go on, go, go on with killing cats. Hmm? Go on with killing cat, cats. Kim Cat? Yeah. You said something about killing cats is stupid. King cats. Oh. King. What the hell is this? Welcome to King Cat's homepage. Okay, this They're video bad. is entitled is entitled "Why Fighting Racism Is Racist." I, do you want to go through this watching of the video? I I'm still confused about what you want me to look at about the king cats. Oh, sure. Can you can you see this? Yes. Okay. Can you hear it? No. I can see your face again. You're not very good at screen share, are you? You sure you can't hear it? You can't see it? I think you've taken it off screen share. Okay, what's happened here? Screen share. Damn it, that's a chat. Screen share. How fighting racism is racist. Share. There we go. Okay. Can you hear it? No. Damn, okay. Um, that's weird. 
Okay, never mind. I'm going to have to sort that out at some point. Ah, uh, oh uh, well. Yeah, it argues the point that fighting... Fucking hell. That fighting racism is racist. How so? Apparently, like, you're saying these people who want to, like, um, ha like enjoy their culture, and you're saying, ah, oh, because they're enjoying their culture, that makes you a racist. You're, you're enjoying your culture into racism because you want to marry someone of the same uh, race as you, like white people, if you want, like, if you're a white person and you want to marry a white person, that makes you racist. That's what it's trying to say. And and because you're fighting against that, that makes you racist. But then... I... Wait, so if you're fighting against... I don't, I don't understand what the hell you're saying. <laughs> okay, so... This is this is one of the points. What? You're not supposed to be here. Anyway, yeah, it's it, what it says is, let's say I'm a person of an ethnic majority, which I am, not in Southeast London though, and um, I want to marry someone and procreate with someone of the same ethnic city. Okay, let's cut that. Yeah, apparently, apparently it's racist because, yeah, oh no, people who fight against that happening is racist. That's what it's trying to say. Okay, I see. Yes, people who fight against that sort of thing are racist because a person should be free to marry whoever they want. Yeah. And procreate with anyone they want. I think yeah. anything that inhibits our freedom is just wrong. It's like oh, very libertarian. <laughs> well, I think it's good though. What racism or libertarianism? Hmm. Which one? Which one of these issues? Libertarian. Isn't okay. Is good. Wait. Wait say racism who, who the hell says racism is good? What? Nazis. Yeah, but KKK. They're all just... What the hell are you doing? With me. Yeah, go on. Yeah, they're all just messed. Mm. They love Jesus, okay? That's, that's the I'm, reason they do. Why is your room spinning? It's really weird. I'm spinning on my chair, that's why. Whee! Anyway, yeah. And, and I've got a little kid under me. And I'm trying to hit his head <laughs> with my chair. <laughs> Bloody that, hell. I'm, I'm trying to hit your head with my chair, so get out. Henry, uh, have you posted anything on your status on Facebook? I can't, no, because I don't want my parents finding out about the show. Why? I just don't. Okay, because no one else is uh, commenting. Hmm. I'll leave another one. Facebook because people were sending like PM PMing me over Facebook. No, nothing. Okay. Any more subjects? For the okay. There's. Podcast. Okay. How I know you're Irish and a pedophile. So how much do you like the Northern Irish? Hey, get like that, get that, get that, get that. This is enough. This is too much. Leave. Leave. I'm, 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 I'm chatting. Go, go, leave. Well, be quiet and stay out of my face. Anyway, uh, so how, how do you like the Northern Irish? How do I like being Northern Irish? Did you say Northern Irish people? Yeah. Uh, I. It depends on the person in question. Okay, like. As a consensus, because you know how they have consensuses of like in America, the consensus of a British person is like, "Oh, I'm British. Let's shag the Queen." Yes, that's the consensus for British people. Yeah. That we just go every day shagging royalty. Thing is, I don't really believe in any of those consensuses. Which, so. which, which, which one of the royal family would you shag? Which one of the royal family would I shag? Mm. Uh, You'd, you'd shag Kate Middleton's baby, wouldn't you? What the hell? What is wrong with you? 
It's you. You're the you're the pedophilic priest here. Pedophilic. Shut up. You're pedophilic and you're priest, father. What? Oh, for Christ's sake. Hey, look what they've done to my Wolfenstein game cover. How the? If I was still a hardcore gamer, I would beat them senseless. I would beat them senseless anyway. <laughs> anyway, go, go, go. Look, go, go to your brother. One viewer sent me a message. How, if, if someone broke your, did this to your Wolfenstein game or your favorite game or anything, because this is the only game I have on PS4, okay. how bad would you beat them? Uh... If someone did that to my favorite thing, I'd probably rip their tongue. I'd, I'd, I mean, thanks God they didn't do it to Black Ops. Because if they would, I, I, they'd, I, I'd be in prison right now. What do you yeah. want? Okay. No. Get out of the picture. You're crazy. You're worthless. <laughs> yeah, Henry, I pray. Okay, okay, back back to um the drunk Northern Irish man. He claims he was Nicki Minaj doing an emergency call. Get off! Get off! No! Stop! Go on, get out! So, how drunk was this dude? I don't know. He just Well, he's Irish and drunk, so that means he must have drunk like a million bottles of pure alcohol. See? Get out! Go on! Go on, get out! This is how I this is how I torture my kids. Get out! Go on. This is my fault. My me being dead dad. Go on, out. Go on. Go on, get out. Go on, take it outside where you can cry and moan and scream. Go on. Go on. See, this is this is, this is how to be a good good uh, big brother. Okay, you shout and scream at them. That's how you'd be a good big brother. Well, I'll definitely remember that for if the day ever comes. Okay. Though, so, I doubt because, it. Because they did this to Wolfenstein. How dare they do this to Blowjob? Oh, yeah, of course. Yeah, his initials are BJ. <laughs> I, I don't understand. What the hell possessed them to um think that... B.J. Blaskovitz is a good name. Well, it came from the 90s, so... When, like, blowjobs were first being in, uh, introduced to the internet. Or whatever. And they're like, <laughs> let's create a game go, uh, a game character called Blowjob. <laughs> yeah. I mean, they must have thought that, uh, with the immaturity of people today, that BJ Blaskovitz isn't maybe the best name. Yeah. Actually, do you want to know? I think Wolfenstein: The New Order is the Bioshock Infinite of the Wolfenstein series. Yeah. Because Bioshock Infinite had nothing to do with Rapture or whatever. I haven't even played it. But. <laughs> but yeah. Okay, Henry. My f good friend Zach says, "Who was the first person to drink cow milk?" Okay, firstly, very, I don't think his real name. I don't think your your, your real name's Zach, Mister F. Why? Uh, it doesn't seem like a name that someone would honestly name their kid. That's a bit rude. His mother must have been drunk and high. Oi, no. At the Don't same say time. It. Don't say that's about You do know I live just to piss people off, just to receive hate. I love getting hate. Don't say that's about Zach. Why? What's what? what can't, why can't I say about Zach? Because he's one of my best friends. Okay. I think people, people don't talk about Anyway, go on, friends. go. What did, you, what did you ask? Yeah. So. Who was the first person to drink cow milk? 
What you mean, like, do you, do, does he mean milk that made from a cow or or milk that came directly from the cow's tip? Uh, aren't they both the same? No, because this one has been put into a... a <laughs> just look at the symbolism here. It's been put into a, um, a, a jug. Okay. And then, yeah, but, then but, when you're drinking, but when you're drinking it directly from the cow's tit, it's like, don't ever make me do that again. In fact, if anyone's watching this, get this, and then put it into a GIF, and um, yeah, make sure it's something funny. And then send it to me. You're crazy. <laughs> No, can you please say something and then make that face again? Because I don't think people got that. <laughs> you are insane. Thank you. I try. Actually, I don't try. It comes naturally, but yeah. Um. Okay. Oh, so. What are we talking about? Where, where, where did we come from? Yes. Where did we come from? That's a very... cows. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So, um, what age did you drink cow's milk at? What age did I drink cow's milk at? I don't know. I was probably too young to remember. No, like between the age of two and about ten, I didn't okay, like it. Okay, okay. Were you you were so, born before me, right? Yes. Yeah, it was it was probably most in in like the laws of likelihood, it was probably you then. Well, I'm pretty sure that people started drinking milk from cows' tits long before I was born. What does he say? Like the first person ever. Yeah. Wait a sec. Yeah. Okay, so I'm just gonna take this time to talk um, about how gay he is. Basically, what happened is that he fucked a Tyrannosaurus's bones until skin started uh, appearing back on the bones. Alright. Hmm. Okay, yeah, so I'll go on. Does he mean the first, like, ever? Or, I assume... Like, the first human person ever, or between the two of us? I think he meant the first human ever. Okay. I, I don't know why you'd ask yeah. that question. Um, there was probably some uh, really horny guy that said, oh my god, that probably yeah, it's, good it's to It's probably sell. a guy who can get laid. Yeah, he was like, oh, look. Uh, this is the cow's version of tits. I'm gonna suck it. <laughs> Probably. Or actually, yeah. there are some theories that um, you know how some women they can't breastfeed their children and so on, mm -hmm. for some reason or another, that they just decided, okay, what animal do we have plenty of? Cows. Let's milk them. But that's just a theory, a cow theory. Indeed, it is. Have you ever seen Game Theory? Have I ever seen? If, any, if anyone has seen the YouTube can channel Game Theory, you would you would you would understand that reference. If not, then fuck you, because you're not a bigger nerd than or as big a nerd as I am. I haven't seen it. Then fuck you. Okay, Henry. Yeah. Zach now says you should freestyle rap. <sighs> Go on then. Um, can you can you quickly describe to him how much I hate rap? Uh, why don't you describe it? Okay, human words um, cannot describe how much I hate rap. So I will um, say it in Gwela, which is the language of demons. <laughs> <laughs> and if you can speak demon, then you'll understand how much I hate rap. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, so, um... Also, why are Lottie and Zach the only people commenting? Lottie says because we should Lottie, talk about... Lottie and Zach are the only people who care. Yeah, thank you guys. <laughs> we've got two. We've got two viewers and only people watching. Thank you. I don't know you, but thank you. Over the attached girlfriend and um, washed up 
a high school musical guy. Shut up. Was 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 Zac Efron in High School Musical? I don't know. Just shut up. Okay, I think he left because there's only one guy watching now. It's overly attached girlfriend. Anyway, hey, uh, what does Lucy say? Uh, she says talk about vintage video games. That's a very broad. What space. do you mean? What do you mean by vintage video games? Do you mean just like retro or Tetris. just old video games? Yeah, yeah this is just. Let's discuss Tetris and Pac-Man. I think the best old-fashioned arcade games are, in order, Space Invaders, uh, Pac-Man, and Tetris. What's I agree, yeah. There? What's hard to say? Wasn't Sonic an uh, arcade game also? Uh, I think oh, that, that was. I think that came later. But, um, no, I'm talking about like before it was put onto a console. Yeah, yeah, it definitely was an arcade game, but it came much later. Mm. And then there was um Mario. That used to be an arcade game, or actually it was Luigi at first. Really? You know, he was like a um, Mario was in actually a lot of other games before before you know the classic uh, Mario sixty four. Wait, here's a what game? He was in lots of other games before the classic Mario 64. Okay. So what other games were they? He was like, he wasn't really like an active presence. What he was, he was more just like a hollow character, which they just randomly put in games. Oh, and right. Then the like, um, bought... What's it in Clash of Clans, Athena? Yeah, like, this is, this is basically it, okay. Um, Nintendo made Mario in it. Yeah. Okay. Well, they had a bunch of other games beforehand, as you would know, and he was a character. He was a spare character model, and eventually they just thought, why don't we put this character model and give it its own game? Okay. I can actually see that. Yeah. What Pokemon do you think is the best one? I haven't played Pokemon, but do you mean like the actual Pokemon series or? I mean the games. Oh, I don't know. Which Pokemon game? I don't know. I haven't played Pokemon. You have not played Pokemon? I've watched the anime. What the hell? I... What are you I've talking about? Anime. I've watched the anime. Are you... Have you been on something for your entire life or something? I, I was playing Yu-Gi-Oh! Don't don't mess with you, Gio. No, I'm talking about the games, you know. I don't care, I was playing... Uh, like, yeah, 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 whatever. I don't care. You, Gio, beats, beats Games! Game. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know what games are. I can't even find it now. Anyway, games! Yeah, I know. I just I know. can't... I, I, I've never played any of them, I'm sorry. Pokemon! Yeah, I've never played them. That's my favourite one. That's a very old one. What's that, Pokemon Blue? No, it's Crystal. Okay. It's but the yeah, first, never, ever, never, ever it's the first ever Pokemon that came out in colour. Basically, the closest I got to a Pokemon game was watching someone else play it. On YouTube. I've heard of people playing Gmod and... Uh, actually, no, I have played... Actually, no... I have played um, Pokemon, but I can't remember which one it was. Um, basically, Diamond or Pearl. Basically, I was invited to a friend's house. No, this was before then, I think. And um, he, it was the one where um, the first Pokemon you get is you choose between three balls, and um, no matter which That's ball you choose, every single Pokemon game you choose between three balls. Okay, but no matter which. Um, Ball we got, we always got Squirtle, so you couldn't. Squirtle's the the big, you know, the fucking weird one, the retarded one, and um, we could we couldn't pro progress past the first fight. Oh, Squirtle. Um, I can't remember which Pokemon game was Squirtle's one of the starter characters. Yeah, yeah, my my favorite starter Pokemon was um Cyndaquil. He was awesome. 
What about what about Pokemon's in general? Like, if you take the anime law and the nothing I really didn't. changes in the anime, just so you know. Um, I didn't watch the anime. That's the thing. I've I've this is gonna be really sad. I watched it when I was thirteen. Like, thirteen when was you when were thirteen. I, yeah, no, no. Think about it this way, okay? I was um, I was starting to be introduced into like proper anime, like. Naruto or whatever, I haven't watched Naruto. I've started watching One Piece. Naruto is terrible, you shouldn't watch that. I, I, so I just thought it was shit, but I've started watching One Piece, which is shit, so if anyone of you watches, want to watch One Piece, don't. Unless you're into repetitive crap, because it made my yeah. brain. That's what I found about Naruto, it was just so repetitive. I mean, I watched the first series, and that was good. But then after the first series, it just became awful. Mm. Yeah, um, but no, like, with um, One Piece, they don't even wait a series, they'll just repeat, like, the t same episode, but with different villains. Mm. Um, like, I'm, I'm on number 90 or something like that, and they repeated the same story arc four times in 90 episodes. Just with different villains. Yeah, that's what I found with Naruto. Mm. I mean, personally, when it comes to anime, nothing beats Helsing. Yes. Yes. I. Funnily enough, I was just about to ask you that. You know how there's Helsing, Ultimate, mm -hmm. which is the other one. There's Helsing Ultimate and there's Helsing. This is just Helsing. Sorry. It's Helsing. Is the original, and it was just called Helsing, and then it's Helsing Ultimate. Okay. Which is consensusly better. Like everyone thinks it's better. Yeah. Well, not necessarily. I've um heard a lot of people who've actually preferred the original. That's because the original is just bad. The like the original is just poorly made and poorly written. Yeah, but that doesn't explain why a lot of people who, have, who I know prefer the original. How much people have uh, you know have actually seen um you who is actually seen Helsing? How many people do you know? That's actually including seen. you. I know about five, and about two of them prefer the original. They're fucking morons, or haven't seen Hel Ultimate. That's a bit rude. Okay. That's very rude. Okay, well, I'm sorry that your friend, that whoever this person, these two people are, are pussies. Um, yeah. But no, think about, like, I'm just going to bring up one, um, one fatal flaw, is that throughout every episode of the originals, most of the characters look completely different. In fact, sometimes it just change in the it's like Alucard, for example, his face would just change in the same in the same shot, which is just like the only reason I like the original is that Alucard's face facial features are stronger. He seems to have put on weight when the when Helsing Ultimate was around. Who is the one person still watching? You really have no time. He really doesn't have a life, it's just one person. Yeah. Talk okay. about time. Um, I <laughs> talk about time. Again. Uh, how long have you been doing this? Like an hour or two? Is that right? Yeah, anyway. Man attempts to swallow drugs taped to testicles. Yeah, I'm going to have to go now. I'm afraid. <laughs> okay. Um, people don't remember to like and subscribe and, and I'll put leave, um, leave comments as well because yeah, we I'll, I'll put our Facebook in the description and you can PM us um, if you if you send us a if you send me a friend request and I don't know you then I won't oh, I'm thinking oh yes I'll also it, yes, that woman um, this woman wanted to be on add me on Skype first and the next time we film and you're on I will um, invite you 
This woman wanted to be on. I don't think I know her. She's uh, an Indian woman, I think. And yeah. Okay. Uh, we are not going live in three, two, one.